Hello. Good evening. This is your streamer, Michael McCaw, here, after a brief absence from the weekend. Uh, so, yeah, I, I fucking suck at doing this, huh? Um, every weekend I've been gone, I just can't bring myself to stream till like, Tuesday or, or Monday or always skip a day somewhere. It, it, it kind of blows. Uh, I haven't been feeling super great. My head's a little headachey, and this room is very stuffy even with the fan on. Uh, so, I'm not feeling super great. But I really wanted to get back to streaming tonight, and also lower the microphone volume a little bit so I'm not peeking. Um, because we're pretty close to the end of Bug Snacks. Uh, we have a few side quests to finish up, and then we gotta do the Isle Big Bigu Snacks. And then, uh, we're done. I'm not gonna go for 100% on stream, just because that'll take way too long. Maybe not way too long, but... There's really... N I don't think you get anything for getting all the achievements, so... There's not a ton you really need to do. And you've seen well over half the bug snacks, so hey. At this point, there's mostly recolors. But I will do, um... I will do as much of this as I can. I don't know if tonight's actually gonna be the finale or not. Uh, I said it was the finale on Twitter, but I might, I might be, uh... I may be wrong. I may be. Bitch, I might be. Um... So... Really quick... So I gotta get a buff of locusts. That'll be my first thing I do tonight. Back here, there's this thing. Uh, I don't know what that's supposed to be, but uh, if you try jumping onto it, it says locked. The triplicate space is not yet available to you. So that's uh, interesting and mysterious and cool and such. So we have to get a buffalo locust. Uh, that would require us to go. Did I get the snack pod here? Yes, I did. Okay. That's going to require us to go to the Sizzlin' Sands. We're going to be heading there quite a couple times tonight, I believe. See, at this point in the game, we're just looking for a bunch of, uh, a bunch of snacks that I either haven't got or don't have on hand. And, uh, we will get them on hand and hand them in. So that other grumpuses can touch them with their hands and then eat them. Yeah. Look at all those snack pods. Alright, so I gotta figure out how to get the buffalo locust. It is this thing over here. So, we know it dives to anything it finds attractive. In this case, uh, peanut butter? No, it wasn't peanut butter. Hot sauce and mayo. Y face, yes. Not mayo, ranch dressing. Uh, it likes ranch dressing. We need to get it over here and, and douse it. Cool, my stick is drifting again, that's nice. Um... Yeah, I'm not going, again, it's, I'm, I'm not doing 100%, but I will do... Oh, that... Hold up, hold up. There we go. Alright, that was way easier than I thought it would be. Spuddy. 
buddy. Okay, so I got that. Uh, we're not going to worry about those. Deal or no deal. Catch up off a locust. Alright, I need to prank the Cantus too while I'm here. Oh, it's only those two. Okay. So I've only got two uh, side quests left. Perfect. Oh, no, that, never mind. Dream bug snacks. Intrap, cheeser, and green peel bug. Uh, intrap. Cheeser's here, isn't it? Hold on. Yeah, there it is. Zips across the dunes at extreme speed. Too bad the trip shot doesn't stick to sand. I, I don't actually have one of those yet. And the cantis. Okay, um... Here's the spuddy. Alright, so I need to catch this thing without... I need to catch this thing without, ex ex without it exploding. And I don't know how to do that. Oh, wait a minute. Not stand still. All right, we got the cheeser. Cheese it. did it, but... Visit Grandma's Barn and Snacks where to put ha hats in your donut snacks. Oh, I didn't even notice that. Cool. Alright, well that's, uh... Something I didn't know about. Well, I did know about it. It's, a uh, There's an achievement for getting ten hats. So, getting a hat is like the equivalent of getting a shiny Pokemon in this game. Uh, I thought they only showed up once you had Isle of Big Snacks unlocked, but I guess not. Alright, so I got the Buffalo Locust. I got the cheeser. I just need the picantus at this point. Picantus. And of course, I need the Matsa Supreme, but I can't get that yet. I believe, like, unlike the other bosses, that this one, this is like, this is a boss. You just can't get it until you do the, uh, thing. Did you hear about the Pokemon rumors? Yes. I heard about possibly sexy Sprigatito final evolution, and I'm just like, ah, cool, I guess. Guard it, guard it, Tito. It's also rumors that apparently there's a new Fire Emblem game in development, and it's almost done. Uh, so I'm wondering if we'll hear about that at the Nintendo Direct on June. Um... Why isn't this thing spawning again? Oh, all the Picantuses are gone. Mm, meaty. Nintendo, please, I'm dying here for news, yeah. <laughs> Don't worry, they'll they'll reveal it. The, the, it'll, it's coming. The Nintendo Direct will be announced on June. It'll be happen the next day on June. Um, and and we'll get all the news, including news about Fire Emblem, and um, and uh, the new Mario game that's coming out that isn't announced but totally exists. We'll get the news that Nintendo bought Mega Man. Wow. 
cool shit, Twitch. Anyway, uh... I, I know it's kind of a th I know it's kind of like, why would Capcom sell Mega Man? But man, after that Capcom presentation yesterday, I'm just like, please just give Mega Man to another company. <laughs> please, so that we can actually get a game in the series. I know, like, look, I know, I know Capcom's actually working on something with Mega Man. But man, Mega Man, does it hurt to not hear anything for like five years. Mega Man 11 came out in 28 and 2017. 2018, excuse me. It came out right before I got my job. And we have not had any Mega Man content since Make Legends 3, goddammit. I would love that. I know that that's like the lowest priority thing that Capcom would ever have on their on their docket. Honestly, just give me a Battle Network collection. Like, I, I know I just played the games and I probably wouldn't play them again. Just acknowledge that Battle Network exists, please. Make me happy. Um, what am I doing, Picantis? Wait, where'd it go? Oh, there it is. Okay, that's weird. It, like, respawned, but then it didn't. Okay, I gotta get the flames off of it, and then just stun it. More like prick on this. Loves cheese. Hate it. Loves uh, other thing. Picantos. Tostidos. Okay, wait. Let me see. Let me see if I can set something up here. Despacito. <laughs> Come on, really? The controller? Oh, really? It takes the hot sauce off of it. Also, off stuff, 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 stuff. Picante, picante, picante. Really? Holy hell, man. You're making. Oh, lordy! Why is this one so hard? I need to be playing 40 chess to get this goddamn thing. Cool. Damn it! There's no way for me to. So I need to like get it close to the water and how am I? Oh man, how am I gonna do this? All right, everything. Retrieve everything. Holy hell! Oh. Way too much for me to, to, to do. I don't know. Why is this one so tough? Like, it's the same thing with the flaming chi poof and the other thing. It's like there's. You have to do like eight steps to catch it, to catch one. 
which isn't the best thing you have to do in a game where that spe that like specializes in catching them multiple times. I don't know which the stars you want, so but I got the name for Sp got a name for Spigatito Cilantro. <laughs> I think I can eat cilantro. I'm not one of those people who has the weird allergy. Or the weird thing with cilantro where it tastes like soap. Oh, the Picantis is back. There's gotta be a much easier way to get this thing. This thing's gonna be. Oh my god. Alright, we need to regroup here. We need to, we need to think. All I need to do is get the flame off of it without making it blow up and then catch it. The problem is, if I stun it now, it's still gonna have flames. If only there was like an easier way to, to get the flame off of it. There's multiple ways to stun it. The problem is just I can't get the flame off of it without it exploding. That stunned it. Cool. Now I can't catch it, though. Because if I try catching it, I'm just gonna catch on fire. So there's nothing I can do. Hmm. I need the soap. No. Hmm. doesn't really help me. I'm <laughs> not gonna lie. That might, though. As long as nothing touches it, we should be okay. You've gotta be shitting me six ways from Sunday here. Weird-ass shot. Okay. I think we have something here. We just need to lure the Picantis over here. Picant, picant, picantis. No, you want me. Picantis, picantis, picantis. Picant, picant. Picant, picantis. Picant. Picant, picantis. Picant, picant. Picant, no, how do I get you off of here? Come on, come on. I just need you to get off of here. This, oh, this thing's gotta be here now? Oh, come on. How 
How do I get you off of here? I don't understand how I can do it sometimes randomly when my back is turned. This is frustrating. All right, we're gonna we're gonna put down a launch pad. There we go. Picantes. Talk about a pain in the grumpus. All right. Let's head back to Snacksburg and start cashing in. See, Buffalo Locus for Cromdo. Uh, the Picantis is for Picantis. Excuse me, is for is for uh, Wamble Wambo. Hambone. Grumble. Grogu. Glup Shitto. I don't know. <laughs> Wamble Gramble. Yep. Oh, I forgot about the load times. Oh, the load times. Gosh, the load times. They have legs. Hi! Uh, chum, I need your help with a matter of grave importance. You see, my seismic readings have been off the charts today, and I fear something terrible is happening just off the coast. Chandler and I are headed to Simmering Springs to investigate, and I'd be greatly reassured if you could join us. Sure, maybe later. Oh no, not again! Hey, um, could, could you help me with something? See, I've got a bad habit of walking around in my sleep, and uh, looks like I've been eating in my sleep too. Yeah. <laughs> so if you see me sleepwalking, be sure to wake me up, okay? Yeah, sure. Don't worry, buddy. Oh, I can't even. F How's it going? I can't actually feed him while he's awake. <laughs> I can only change what he's eaten. All right, he needs the picantis, right? I want to fuck this up. Yeah, praying picantis. Okay. Where is it? There it is. Oh, hey, here's the hat rack. Did you know, bug snacks are sometimes seen wearing hats that grumpuses have left behind. Consult the hat board for hints of any active hat sightings. Oh, I guess that means, uh, the desert. Picantes. Uh, yummy. Uh, probably left Cheeto dust all over my hands. Dress. Triffany's helmet. Oh, that's so cool! I like. I have the snack to trade. Great work now. Now hand it over and watch me work. Oh, man, I am stuffed thanks to my friend here. I couldn't eat another snack. Guess I'll just throw away this delicious buffalo -cust. Did you say buffalo -cust? Oh, Hold on now, Cromdo. I'd be happy to take it. Take it? I don't do charity, Triff. Uh, what do you want for it? Well, I happen to be in a market for a treasure map. Never mind. See ya. Whoa, 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 whoa. <laughs> What's the deal here? I'm not letting a crook like you get a hold of that map. 
You'll just swipe the bug snacks and sell them off. No, 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 wait, 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 wait. I, 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 now what? Yeah. Business as usual. Usual. I try to play nice and fair. I get a door slammed to my face. Yeah, well, if Triffity thinks I'm a crook, I'll show her a crook. We're gonna steal that map. Okay. Meet me outside her hut. Midnight. No cops. <laughs> All right, pal, here's the plan. I'll keep watch and turn away any looky loos while you sneak upstairs all quiet like and nab that map. Got it? This seems like a crime. Oh, uh, yeah, 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 yeah. No, no, no. Yeah, yeah. No, I'd, I'd do it myself. Believe me, it's just that I got this uh, this condition where I'm deathly allergic to uh, to jail time. Yeah, don't swear to pal. Seems legit. Oh, great. Sorry, I have to do something real quick. Snack bone. Ow. Yummy, yummy, buddy. Uh, Here, like egg. egg. Enjoy a tasty egg. Spider. Oh, I like that. Alright, Gramble, you're looking good. Alright, what did she want? Cheeser, green pill bug, and inch wrap. Okay, we got a cheeser. We can put that in there. Okay, good. Uh, what was that? Cactus? Yes, it's me, Cactus. Oh, yeah. Love you, Cactus. Prickly pear. Got the goods. Oh, 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 nice job. Easy as pie. You're a blight on society. <laughs> Look, I'm not a bad guy. When I got my bug snacks, I'll pay Triffity back way more than this is worth. Anyway, we're gonna have to wait a while for the heat to die down. Until then, zip 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 zip! Lip zip, got it? Yeah, take care. My lips are zipped. Ah, oh, not again! I should tie myself down. Hey, what is your body right now? Hey! There we go. That looks good. At this point, is Cromdo or Cromdo and uh, Shelter are the only two I haven't fully transformed? I think. Phil wants to talk to me. Not yet. Keep it going here. All right, Befika goes to the bathroom. Uh, chum, I need your help with a matter of grave You told me this importance. yesterday. You see, my seismic Chandlo and I are headed to... Maybe later. Not today, please. Have your big bug snacks. Uh, those sure are biggins. Well, no matter what size, there's always room for more in my family. I'm sure they'll fit in just fine. Bye. Bye. 
Visit Gramble later. Love is patient. Okay. Cramdo, what do you want? Ciao. Nothing. Is that the end of his thing? Oh yeah, that's it. Huh. All right, so visit Gramble later. So let me go get the Entrap and the Green Peel Bug. Where are those located? Actually, in the meantime, let me finish feeding Ch Chandlow here as well. Spuddy. Here. Soda body. <laughs> I think that's everyone except Shelda now. Shelda's the only one who's not complete. See you soon. Here, take this pallet toss too, just so I don't have it in my Ritz ear. <laughs> yeah. It's a cheese Ritz too. Those are better than the uh Evening. better than the uh the peanut butter ones in my opinion. Okay, green peel bug. Well here's the, the intrap is in Flavor Falls. I believe the green peel bug is there too. Unless it's somewhere else. Oh no no no, that's in uh but it's in Scorched Gorge. Okay. All right, let's. Egg wrap. Egg. That sounds like it's saying egg wrap. Okay, let's go to Flavor Falls and get one of those, and then let's go get the thing, the green peel bug. Oh, the, the, intro, the snack wraps are down here, aren't they? That's it, isn't it? Caramel goop. Yep, there it is. Inch wrap. Got the pinkle. The inch wrap. Alright, and to Scorch Gorge. This game is very fun despite its frustrations. So, uh, let's see, what have I done the last few days? This weekend was kind of just a relaxing thing. I went with Nessie and we just went back to her place went shopping, and uh, we just kind of hung out over the weekend, and then same thing's gonna happen this weekend. I'm going to see some other friends of mine, and we're gonna do, like, an early thing for my birthday this weekend, which will be nice. We're just gonna, like, hang out and maybe go out for a little bit, and then uh, the weekend after that, I'm gonna be here, because uh, Somnium Files comes out, and I don't want to miss that. And then it's off to Pittsburgh for a week. Yes, we got the remaining uh, few trailers for Live Alive today. 
all eight of the uh, time periods now have a trailer for it. It, it looks good. I mean, it's we haven't seen it, much of it since the reveal, and those trailers don't reveal much outside of the characters and some of the voice actors, which are overwhelmingly British, it turns out. Uh, there are... It's weird because, like, it definitely sounds like they're using voice actors from different regions, but it just seems mostly British and, and American. And yeah, we got, we got the trailer for Cube today. Our buddy Cube. But the thing is, Cube does talk. Because he offers coffee. And yet, I don't know. Whenever they portray him, he does that noise. Computer noises, but in British. But yeah, um, that looks... I cannot wait for that. That's going to be the end of July. July 22nd. Uh, Chum, you no, see, stop. my Chandlo and I are headed to... We know. Later. Oh, my gosh. We just start the search. Oh, so well, this thing isn't over. All right, hold on. Let me go over here and... I made more offerings to the box. Oh, great. <clears throat> One is please. Anybody want a Another coffee? Another step taken along the path. Return one day hence, uh, again. Can't wait to, uh, can't wait to play Captain Square in the remake and get utterly frustrated at it. All right now, Manny. I just follow the pointer and... Oh! Wait, come back! Manny! Benatalie's name! Benatalie. They left me. I guess that's just what family does. Well, it doesn't help that you're made of bug snacks barely ever talk to you. Then one morning you wake up and they're gone without so much as saying goodbye. I thought bug snacks would be simple. They don't have it in them to be cruel, but the cruelest thing you can do is not care at all. Oh, maybe I should pay Wiggle a visit. Uh, after I fix the fence, of course. Love is patient. Complete. Oh, nice. Alright, well that's, uh... That's his story done. Thanks for helping me build up my family. Even if they don't appreciate it at all, I sure do. I guess that makes you part of my family, too. I made you your very own strabby hat, so whenever you feel cold or alone, please wear it and think of everybody who loves you. Ramble. So apparently there's a whole second floor you can make to your house, but you can't do it until you've completed enough of those, um... Enough of these side missions. Yeah, roof. Soda boy, ready to start the search? <laughs> ready to get rich? <laughs> Hope you got your sunglasses, pal, because we're heading to the sizzling sands. Slice of heaven. Oh, so this is the boss fight. Sands Undertale. Sizzling Sands Undertale. Oh, I can smell it! This is gonna be the big one. My ticket out of this dump! After this, I won't have to work another day in sales for the rest of my life. I'm gonna use the cash to open a little karaoke bar where I can serve fancy drinks and sing as loud as I want! And I'll owe it all to bug snacks. Oh, and, uh, you, of course. Of course, surely, me. Hey, check it out. An old-timey casket. Wonder if there's treasure in there. Hey, hey, get it, get it, get it. Don't cut it. Eh, yeah, whatever. On to the real price. No, but I want to open that. Perhaps it needs to be cut open. This is the place. Looks like we gotta do something to call the bug snack out. 
Should be a switch right about. Da, 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 da. Ah, here! Oh, hey, cool. Whoa, that is something, all right. But it looks like we still gotta blow this thing open. See if there's anything good and explosive around here. Good and explosive. Bambino. When threatened, this bug snap becomes an explosive bomb. Ah, eating this is like biting a tiny volcano. Oh, I actually can't catch it. Don't let me down, my sweet baby, Bambino. around here. Check around that coffin of those, uh, those big statues. Ah. Uh. Yeah, I'm walking here. Okay, wait, what is it like? Uh, Nothing. Uh, I mean, it, there's hot sauce right here, so maybe... Huh, wait a second. I'm noticing that there's a slicer over here as well. And over there. Feels like a puzzle that I'm gonna have to figure out here, huh? Come on, there's gotta be some boop. with the boom already. I don't know what to do now. Oh, wait. Huh. There it is! My piece of the pie! Come on down here, you muddy angel! Alright, well... Ah, I see... Wait, no, they're, they're on fire, though! This 
doesn't really help. They're on fire still. Give you a subject to draw? Scooby Banoopy. <laughs> I don't know. Tito. <laughs> Grumbling while buried in sand. <laughs> to it <laughs> you'll see what you can do it's okay just draw whatever you feel comfortable with it doesn't look like it actually did anything though oh I have to hit the fucking slicer on it I'm an idiot all right Buddy, you need to come over here. What are you doing? Oh, you know what's coming if you do that. Oh, yes, I do know what's coming if you do that. Okay, come on, dude. I, I need you. I need your help here. Why are they all over here? All other places, please. Again, this feels like it's one step too many to get to the point where I can actually attack it. Wait, no! The, the thing's gone. That's a lot of them, yeah. Alright, at least I know what to do now. Hello? All that monster hunter noise. Lock onto it. Just slices just disappear outright. Okay, stop with the wind! Bambino is the small is the is the sub for it. I'll be coughing up sand for a week. 
but with those new bug snacks, I can just buy new lungs. <laughs> <laughs> Feed one Matsu Supreme. All right. Well, you're graduating from from soda can body to pizza body. Nice work, pal. Let's go home and we'll count up the spoils. It's kind of messed. It's kind of weird too, because you can't technically get those again. So only Cromdo gets pizza body at the end. Like I could get the smaller pizza, but not the small. I get the Bombinos, but I can't get any more pizza bo body. He looks like a Spinda. It kind of does. All right, fast travel to Snacksburg. Last train to Snacksburg. Uh, what else happened this weekend? Nothing. Just a whole lot of nothing. Capcom did their thing on Monday. Uh, we're getting Resident Evil and Monster Hunter stuff. Cool, cool. Again, Mega Man just dead in a ditch. Um, unfortunately, he has a pepperoni butt. Uh, what happened today? Today was the Xbox Extended Showcase, which was a whole lot of nothing. Just a lot more of what it was. Oh, Sunday was the Xbox thing in general. And, uh, there was games and cars and some more games. It, it, some stuff looked cool. Now, would I go out and buy an Xbox Series X? No, probably not. Would I buy a PS5? Maybe. There is a Final Fantasy VII thing happening this week. Where we might get the announcement of uh, Remake Part 2. That's kind of what everyone's hoping for. <laughs> well, pal, even if our scheme went south, you still end up your end. Held up your end. I may be a liar and a cheat, but I pay my dues. Unfortunately, all I've got left is this crummy old boombox, so just take it. It's not like I'll be needing it anytime soon. Cromdo. What's a step up from the record player? We are ready to receive your wisdom, O oh great Shelda. One who stands atop the mountain cannot see beneath the waves. So it is one must dive to see the mountain top clearly. Wait a minute, you got bug snacks in you. No, I don't. <laughs> Darling, it's clear as day. Good for you. Change things up a little. Uh, 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 the toxin is spreading through the very air. One is tainted by your miasma of snacks. Leave now, so that one may be purified. I don't think that's how it works. Chill, bro. It's a metaphor. Yes, that. Walk in the light of the mother, my children. Having trouble? <laughs> One is not so easily led astray. So it is. The greatest temptation begets the greatest faith. Sprinklepeed, Pilatos, and Flapjackarack. Oh, come on. These heinous toxins must be brought to the What the hell box. even is the Sprinklepeed? <laughs> False idol. Cut the end. One who is me is certain. Yada, yada, yada. Just get the grumping snacks already. Man, oh man. Uh, Chum Shush, Snorpy. See, my seismic Go fast and I somewhere just... else, please. Not now. Befica, to what do I owe the dishonor? Cut the grump, Cromdo. You're gonna give me a piece of that pie. And why would I do that? Maybe you're feeling generous. Or maybe you don't want Wambus to see all these pictures of you stealing Triffany's stuff. You sneaky little grump! You give me those pictures right now, or I'll... Oh, Wambus! All right, all right, all right, all right! Shh, 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 shh! You win. Take a Beth. Beth! And yours over, pal. Oh, no need. I'd never sell up my bestie. <laughs> Remake part two, hopefully, character doesn't... Yeah, I don't even think it's gonna get up to that point, honestly. <laughs> I think it's going to get up too close to that, and then stop just short of it. 
I think... Actually, no, you know what? I think it might get... Because it, that's the end of Disc 1. I think we might get up to the end of Disc 1 in Part 2, but I'm not sure yet. We don't know. Wait, you still you more? This is your just desserts. Desserts? Hey, you don't get it, pal. It doesn't matter if I'm honest or dishonest. Either way, I lose out in the end. You think I like being a scumbag? A grifter? A hustler? It's all miserable. So why do it? Because then, I got some tiny, minuscule chance of living my dream. But I wasn't born rich, and that means I can't afford to be happy. So unless you're gonna buy something, get lost, pal. Oof. Oof, duh. All right. All right, I think that's everyone except Sheldon now. And of course, she's being a greedy SOB, and I've got to, uh... Murph, hey, Atman, how you doing? Well, if that isn't some realistic stuff right there, yeah, exactly. All right, I need a flapjack -a rack from the sizzling stands, a pallet toss, which is easy. I can get that from the simmering sand. Uh, that's the, the, the boiling bay. I don't really need any other uh, snacks, do I? Defeat all the oh no, I defeated all the legendary bug snacks. Cool, so that's that one down. Midnight snack, transform cramble. So all I need to do now is feeding frenzy. Kind of okay. Yeah, it's kind of the feeling on my end too. So I just need to finish turning Shelda into more food. There, she's got all those. Alright, Palatos. That's, uh... Boiling Bay. Speaking of snacks, I got a new box of uh, Jack Links the other day. Because I was down to three. Now I have 22. I usually get a new box every two months or so. And I try to limit myself to like five to ten a month. <laughs> Which is probably still too many. Those, those things are heavily processed, mechanically separated chicken. Not exactly the best thing to be eaten. Jackrack is in the sands, right? Sizzling sands. Stirs up dust devils flying anything in its path high into the air. How do I get that again? I think I have to have the, the loaded spuddy run into it. Well, I'm only missing one here. The score pepper. Sprinkle peed. 
right, that's not here. Quickie. That's a peel bug. yet. That's not good. Right, the flapjack rack isn't out yet. Look, it's this closed back up afterwards. want to summon this legendary bug snack. Summon the bug snacks. Don't. Oh, maybe you can get more than one now once you have this, uh, that unlocked. I wonder if there's ones for all the other ones out where you find them originally, too. So this dude is the only one I don't have yet. Seems like it. Right, it's flip it, right? Or did I need to stun it? Takes care of that. Oh look, I love big snacks. Snorpio would like to talk to you about something. Okay. Well, we're not doing that just yet. So we have Palatos and, and Flapjack Rack. We need a sprinkle peed. Where the hell is the sprinkle peed? Not there. Sugar Pine Woods. Maybe 
Maybe it's that. Because that's got multiple... That, yeah, that's got many legs. Okay, so it's probably the sugar pine woods. Yeah, it's probably it's probably a sprinkle cookie or something. So it's probably the sugar pine woods. Nails over there. Catch big bopsicle while uh did I already have big bopsicle as well? No, I don't. Heavy, get my way! Oh. Stun it before, and then it's like, no. That's a goal. That's a goal. Snack seems to appear at night. Okay. Sprinklepeed, but that's... Oh yeah, no, okay. Likes to climb high structures, maybe some sauce could get it to move. Oh, so it's a donut, okay. Where did the center go? 
Where did the center go? Is there a sprinkle peed hole running around? Loves peanut butter and chocolate. Okay. Oh my god, look at this. Look at this path. Okay. No, 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 touch the chocolate. What's wrong with you? Hello? What? Why? Why does the game do this to me? It's like you have... S you finally figure it out and then the game's like, No, we're not gonna allow you to do that. Just because. There's no reason why this shouldn't be able to attach to this wall over here. Like, why is it doing that? It's wood just like the other side. There's zero reason why this is not working. I must be literally crazy right now. I must be taking crazy pills. <laughs> There had to be, like, five extra steps. Like, again, it's always like there has to be a nuance that allows you to not be able to do it the way that looks the most logical. <laughs> I feel like it was purposely just messing that up to make things harder. Whatever. I got it. Challenge completed. Completed head hurty. Ah, oh, man. No. 
smush. Snorpy. Yo! I made more offerings to the box. Again. Thanks. I guess. You okay? No. What's the point? You already know I'm a fraud. Sidetracked. Nice. I might as well save my energy. Why put on an act? Well, it's not entirely an act. I really do mean everything I say. It's just... Nobody's gonna listen to Shelsey Woolbag from Nowheresville. But... It's a nice place. I've been there before. Sheldon! One who is wise. One who is pure. One who is invincible. I have to set an example for the others. I can't let bug snacks have power over me. I'm supposed to be better than that. But you ate them anyway. I ate them. Because I'm not better than that. Despite all my years, I'm still weak and clueless. If I've got any wisdom left to share, it's I'm not to end up like me. That achievement feeding frenzy. Yeah, baby. Well, you know the truth about me. Can't tell if I feel more embarrassed or relieved. In the spirit of div divesting myself, I want you to have my old crystal. It may not have mystical powers, it may be completely useless, but it's a nice rock all the same. Shelzy. Complete all the side quests. Fully transform every Grumpus. Hell yes. On a bug snack with a shot attached to your buggy ball. Still don't have that yet. I don't really need any of those anymore. Pop, Tevin, thank you for following me. How you doing? I have seen you around. How you doing? Also, my voice really cracked when I said pop there. Oof. One more, please. I mean, I don't really need it anymore. Well, kinda. Hey yeah, hey yeah. Okay, so uh Salutations. Yes, hello, hello Floof Day. Um Sleep till noon. Clear out the cache of any any crap happening here. So before I do the post game stuff, I'm gonna do the ending again. Wow. This part Yes, yes, we already know. So This is awesome! It turns out that uh, you can't you can't lock yourself out of getting the good ending. You can lock yourself out of getting the bad ending, because finishing someone's side quests prevents them from dying. One who is I understand. And during the ending, completely. Great Shelda. you're saying I should chug this snack water upside down, dog. Yes. I could just kind of speed through this. A hot. There we go. If I knew. Duh. Duh. You know I. I go with that Snorpy. It's yeah. a party. Mm. <sighs> but these. Sure. So yes. Um. Aww. Even if they're all fully transformed, and die in one hit, uh, if you complete their side quest, they defend themselves. Which means that since I've done every side quest, it's literally impossible to get the the bad ending now. So it's a good thing I actually showed it off. <laughs> There's a party in my mouth and I'm invited. Whoa. So 
So the osteo. Ah. All right. Sip and disappear. <laughs> this part. Oh gosh. I... Oh yeah. Uh huh. I hope you're a excellent as you and uh, be at. I have something important. You're interrupting rhythmic gyration. Hey, now, nah. Grandpa. You... I don't know, oh. but I no. Woohoo! Snack walk. What are you kidding? Oh yeah. Uh huh. All right, here, one for you. Mm -hmm. Adel. Uh, uh, look at this. Uh. Oh, God. Oh. Watch my moves. It's as good as my singing. So you see, fast. Oh, yeah. Tiffany. Phew. I'm all talked out. Makes me want to. <clears throat> Chandler, I, I keeping this one. We've been good. together for so long, and I've always wondered how you feel about me. Do, do you want to be my boyfriend? What, bro? That doesn't make any sense. Oh, I see. Y yes, never mind. F forget what I said. Snorpy, we've been dating for years. W wait, what? But how is that possible? Dude, remember that time we made out on that Ferris wheel and I said we should move in together? Uh, well, well, yes, I, I just thought that we were roommates with benefits. You know I hate ambiguity. Sorry, Snorp Dog. Is that clear enough for you? <laughs> I love you, dog. Now let's dance! I get this part. Me, besides this. This isn't really your song? Okay. Woohoo! Ah, right. Me, besides this. Yeah, what song do you want? Huzzah! That's it. Me besides no. oh, Come on, Befica. Why are you beefing with me here? Hubba, hubba. OMG, they're playing. There we go. Gonna be seeing this one one more time after after I get the true stuff for the secret ending, but we're doing the good ending right now. We did it, buddy. We're all together again. Well, almost all of us. But you know what? Knowing Egabella's out there gives me hope that Lisbert is out there too. I mean, none of this would have been possible without you, buddy. I know you have to go back for your job eventually, but sure miss you if you left and well you still need to interview Lisper, right so our end is nigh what end well is, is that a metaphor or and you really just can't skip this part can you move. Now. Uh, are, are you okay buddy yeah, I am. Can we just get to the part where All we right. move? All right. I know this looks bad, but as long as we keep calm... Our doom approaches! Pray to your gods, children! It's the queen of bug snacks! She's rising from the depths to devour us all! The Grandpa Nati aimed to silence us for good. Their machinations are coming to fruition! Uh, this now, is a hold on. We're not gonna die because of some cult or monster. That's right. We're gonna die because the volcano's going off. That's right. Wait, what? Oh, and I, I just want to see what was up. Oh, sure. Well, thank you for stopping by. Like Take care. Dead. Have a good night. Come on, thank you. bro. We can survive this. As long as we got bug snacks, we'll be fine. 
My barn collapsed. All of my little ones escaped. Bummer. Whoa, 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 whoa. We're homeless and out of bug snacks? Oh, it's a grumpy grump world now. <laughs> uh, dibs on eating Philbo. Please do. I'm quite curious to see the result. Will Befica turn into Philbo or the bug snacks he's eaten? Hold on a moment while I retrieve my notes. Hey, 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 don't give up yet. We may not have homes or snacks, but we have each other. I know it's pretty scary right now, but we can't fall apart every single time something bad happens. We have to stick together. Well said, Philbo. Egabro! Egabro! You're all right! What a pleasant surprise. Welcome back, Dr. Batanugget. Hey, everybody. Chandlo, Floofty, Mr. Troubleham. Doc. I'm glad you made it. Does that mean you figured it out? That's right, Philbo. I know how to get to Liz. That's amazing! We gotta go right away! Oh, sorry to say it, but is now really the best time? This might be the only chance we get. Liz is in danger, and this disaster is only getting started. The worst is yet to come. So spills fall for toxin unending! Quiet, you! Doctor, you are only subjecting yourself to needless risk. Elizabeth is likely deceased. Dog, this bird is alive. And we're not gonna leave her behind. I just need Philbo and, uh, Philbo's buddy. Sorry, Chandlo. Bummer. Well, what are the rest of us supposed to do while y'all were gone? You prepare for the worst. What do we need right now? Well, I'm sick of being in the dark, for one. I want to know what's out there. No worries, Beth. I'll build a couple bonfires, maybe a watchtower. Whatever's out there, we'll see it coming. Yeah, but yeah, what yeah. do we do when the queen comes to devour us? Well, I have a few prototype traps that I could put to use. How about the more practical threats? You know, the earthquakes, the volcanoes, and what have you. Simple. We find a way to get off the ground if the need arises. Well, none of that matters if I starve to death. We got my sauce. <laughs> no way, pal. I ain't gonna chow down on that nasty plant goop. Mm. I stand corrected. No more concerns? Great. Let's get to it, then. The hunt. Okay. Whoa. After we get Lizbert, are you two gonna come back to town? Oh, I don't know. I'm starting to like sleeping on freezing cold. Oh, I like how you can. <laughs> but I'm sure Liz misses our bed. Well, it'll be ready for ya. I've been keeping your hut clean for whenever you got back. Yeah, no, no, no. We don't need to listen to that. So I watched a speed run of the game without spoiling the good ending. Um, and uh, it is very quick. You could skip a lot of loading zones and go straight to the end of the game. Essentially what happens is you glitch yourself up to the mountain peak at the beginning, and then you glitch yourself through the door, and that immediately activates the end game. <sighs> mountain. Still. Tall. Oh, do you need a break? Uh, how about water? Let me check your vitals. No, oh, no, I'm okay. Besides, we're, we're almost there. Right! But in the future, you could stand to do some exercise, or... Or just hang out with Chamlo. All right, we're here. Um. Open, Egabel. Turns out she wrote the order backwards. 
I guess even the great Elizabeth Megafig can still make mistakes. Well, <laughs> Poe Buddy's nerfigged, right? <laughs> okay, I'm ready when you are. We're coming, Liz. One, two, three! Pleat. Keep it going, keep it going, keep it going, keep it going, keep it going. We still got a significant amount of this left to go. stuff. Ugh, it's slimy and cold, and I, uh, I, uh, I kind of want to eat it. Uh, if Lizbert is really down here, we better find her fast. Remember how I went down that other tunnel, and there's like a jump scare in there for some reason? <laughs> Let them through. Up, 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 up. Oh, okay. No, Phil Are you serious? My job is on the line here, so. I regret inviting you. You came here to interview. Ah, bug snap. That's. I almost lost myself. But somehow I pushed back. I made them into me. <sighs> this. That's. They're pain. Well, we already know all this. What you they all sushi woman. Say so if you skip that uh that bug snacks yeah. golem monster question, you that golem actually lost. doesn't despawn, it just stands there until the end of the uh, conversation. If you say if you ask that question it despawns Wait, at that point instead. What are you mean? It's only a uh, I'm sorry, me. What are you So now is oh, well, no. know all this already. We've seen it. We're gonna be seeing it again too, one more time. Get up! Hey, no! Uh, I, if, huh? Move! See, it would. Wait. Oh. Mm. So. Oh. But I. What? Ba -ba 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 -ba. Okay. It's time to get moving. Get back to snacks, boo. Time to get I'm moving. Going to have to take a bit of a shortcut. Hold on. It's time to get moving. Time to get moving. Now that uh, Banjo Kazooie's on NSO Online, I'm wondering if we're gonna get a uh, Banjo Tooie and, and Blast uh, Blast Core. I've never actually played Blast Core. Jeff Force Gemini would be a really good game to get on N64 Online as well. So now the nice thing is that during this whole ending sequence, I could fuck up as much as I want, and I won't get the uh, bad ending anymore, because everyone will defend themselves. Uh, Agabo? Is that you? Oh, sorry, buddy. Head hurt. Oh, bad. Not dream time yet. Gotta save... friends? Yes! Yes, save friends! If I realized how long it was going to take to speed through this, I probably would have just skipped getting the good ending and gone right to the, the secret ending. 
because I'm pretty sure they're both pretty close to each other. But we've got to get back to Snacksburg as fast as we can. We can't let the others eat any more bug snacks. If they transform all the way, then 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 who knows what will happen? Alex Sorpo. Great. So it's still worth doing this because it makes it go quicker if you actually try to hold help everyone. Snor hold oh, don't worry. Splendid. As for you, you may need my snack chop. It's much like the snack trap if it were set to uh, puree. Good luck. Okay. Uh, <laughs> also, Philbo can't die no matter what. It turns out he's always living no matter how much he's transformed. Floofy. Stay still, you pugnacious pests! Gah, why did Snorberton make this so cumbersome? One has foreseen. The bug snacks will be five feet to the right of where you're aiming. I'm a scientist, not an exterminator. You do it if you're so inclined. One is strictly a pacifist. Also, one is pushing 70. Not enough. Ah, but here comes someone with a healthy capacity for violence. Take this device and clear a path for us, please. Got it. Yep, see, they just knock him away now. Really cool. Enough mortal danger for one day. Let's abscond while the bug snacks have subsided. You don't have to tell me twice. You, however, must continue. The others still need your help. <laughs> Come on, uh, Tom. I just don't worry. <gasps> I'll pilot the help. <sighs> And again, I guess it's, it's already Wednesday. I usually empty out my garbage can Thursday. Nothing but law. You got this, bro. Uh, no. <laughs> 
<laughs> you guys didn't even need my help. <laughs> we crushed it, dog. Um, don't celebrate too soon. We're not safe until we're off this horrid rock. To the balloon. The balloon. Don't worry. There's one thing. You got it. Fire in the hole. Whoa! It's almost a shame to waste it like this. Oh, bestie. But now that you. Hey, sure. Yeah. Again, you've seen it. Oh, oh, that's heavy. There you go. Another one. Wow, that's cool. Uh... Another one. That stands there and does nothing. <laughs> The speedrun section of this is ridiculous because like they just aim and fire ahead of time and they're always just on point with it. Go after a uh, condo. Me five bug coins. Run away, snacks, never come back. Oh, <coughs> I don't get it. Why are the little ones attacking us? They love me. They're like a mob of adoring fans, darling. They love you so much that they they each want a piece of you. Even so, I can't bring myself to to hurt them. So why'd Snorpy have to go and weaponize Sprout? I thought I had Sprout Man, too. Why? Why did I he get him back? I you were so punk rock. I'm not a punk or a rock. I, I can't do this. Well, I know who can. Darling, I've got them all warmed up. It's time for you to bring the house down. Burn them down the house. All right. Kill Barry. Yeah. Yeah. How is the Barry still under my control here? So apparently there's a glitch in this fight in the original release where uh, if they if you knocked a bug snack back onto the rocks behind this, uh, it wouldn't count as a defeat surface, so they wouldn't actually die. Magic, yeah. Alright. 
Is it over? Wait. No time for an encore, Greg. <laughs> Come on now! Get! Get! Get your varmints! It's no use, Wambi. Must have learned a few things since the Stone Age. Well, what do you want me to do? I won't let them take my garden. There's hardly any garden left. There's enough. I still got my special sauce, fresh grown. Oh, good thinking. What? That's not what I meant. Oh, I didn't see you there. Would you mind helping out? Just a matter of life. Look how she's rescuing the cactus. Special sauce. <laughs> So apparently the quickest way to do this is anytime they spawn, I just want to throw between About as big a break as we're gonna get. Come on, Wamby. It's now or never. Oh, I gave it my best. All right, Triffy. Let's go home. <laughs> Escape from Snack Tooth. Okay, we're all here. Though I think the balloon needs another minute. <laughs> Achievement survivor. Oh, nice. <laughs> Must be not to let anyone die in the ending. Now! Kind of a guaranteed uh, achievement as long as you fill all the side quests. Come on, we're not gonna make it. Thanks, Liz. Egg. Ham. Cheese. Chunk and cheese. Mm. Achievements, vacations, and wow, you're getting a get a lot just for doing it normally. All of the Grumpus' survive. Complete the main story of Bug Snacks. Oh, so you have to get the good ending to get that one. Wow, I've kind of uh, done almost everything already, aside from just get all the Bug Snacks and do the bonus stuff. Well, there goes another farm. Serves me right for building it on top of an island-sized pest. <laughs> I guess there's no shame in starting fresh. I'll find a place with rich soil, and even richer history, where me and Triffy can settle down. I was so close to giving up back there. I get so caught up dwelling on the way lives end. But that's not the only thing that matters, yeah? Wambus and I, we're gonna start the rest of our lives today. Wambus. It's funny. I spent all my as we floated down. I call it an ode to Gramble. I thought I'd be real sad when I left all my little ones behind. But I feel okay. I don't know. Maybe it helps they tried to murder me. Most of, the, most of this is the but same. Also, We've already seen this. I got folks who love me back for real. Like, well, Wiggle. Ugh. Hey, bestie. I think I need a vacay from this vacay. Going home doesn't seem so bad anymore. In my old life, 
my old friends. They're all gone. But like, now I know that I can make new friends. And this time, I won't ruin it for myself. Okay, I know when I'm beat. I draw the line at island full of monsters. <laughs> All I wanted to do was quit my dead-end job and do what makes me happy. I don't need some big bug snack scam to do that. Hey, maybe I'll get started in the music business. Well, you're alive this time. While I regret that all my research was destroyed, I have come away with a revelation. I cannot improve Grumpus Kind if I refuse to understand it. It may be a long and frankly annoying endeavor, but it is one worth pursuing. While I regret that I can't, it may. I've never felt so wrong being. I don't need to be all powerful to give good advice. I just need to be me. And those who listen will listen. Uh, also, you might want to get rid of the burrito teeth. Look at that mess. It seems my enemies aren't so all powerful after all. But still, there were many close calls. And Chandler was always there for me. I think perhaps I could share everything with him. Bro, that was intense. There's no way I ever would have made it out of there by myself. Good thing Snorpy had my back. When did he get so strong? Maybe I hit my personal limit. But that doesn't matter. There's no limit to what we can do together. Yeah, love. Hey, buddy. Are you ready to go? Hey, buddy. Hey, buddy. All right, everybody. We should head out. Oh, it doesn't even give you the option to do it over if anyone... Because, yeah, if anyone dies, you... Uh... Like oh, wait, no. Hm. Liz and Egg. What if they're still out there? Liz and Egg could take care of themselves. Yeah. Can't be thinking. No, you're right. You have to move on. I know. I can't go wallowing in regret now. We're barely even out of the woods. It's gonna take a while for the bug snacks to wear off on us. I can't go back home like this, so... Is it alright if I stay with you for a while? I can help you with your story. Maybe figure out which parts to tell, or... I guess I've got spare room. Great. <laughs> Let's go. It's funny because people point out you could still have bug snacks in your inventory at this point, and it's like, uh oh, you've just infected I have everyone. To admit, you got guts. Dragging down Elizabeth inside an erupting volcano? It's compelling, dramatic, sensational. I'd call it fiction if you didn't have this Philippus Yahoo along as a witness. <laughs> it's Philbo, actually. Point is, you're a regular Grumpter S. Thompson. It's just too bad those bug snacks weren't real, huh? <laughs> yeah, too bad. <laughs> I, I, I hate to think that we went through all that for nothing, so... Um, I hope you can spread the truth about Snack Tooth before anybody else gets hurt. Don't worry. GNN specializes in painful truths. And speaking of, you're fired. This story's a page-turner and all, but you lost your job the second you walked out that door. How dare you? Oh, please. It's not like I expected you to come back. Also, you're legally dead. Might want to clear that up soon. Well, that wasn't ideal, but you've had worse days, huh, buddy? So, I hear the elections are coming up, and, uh, I, I was thinking of running for mayor. I could use a help. Sounds good, Philbo. I think there's a scene after the credits. And that's where the majority of the good ending stuff is. But then when you once you do the Isle of Big Snacks, it changes to a different scene. Run for mayo instead. <laughs> Interesting how even that wears off at the end, but still, it's cool. This game is fun. There's definitely a lot more to it that I could do, but it's like, I, 
kind of want this to be over now. I've been playing this a lot longer than I thought I was. I also just haven't been streaming as much as I should be. So that's kind of like... Eh. I keep forgetting I did... No, you know what? I did stream a lot. I just keep forgetting I did Kirby between Ace Attorney and this. But, uh, anyway. We're not, we're not done with this yet. In fact, I don't know if I'm gonna finish this tonight, just because I think the remaining area takes a bit of time to get through. And then I have to do the ending again as well. happening. What else is coming up? I don't know. I don't think there's... Is there any other, like, gaming things happening this week outside of the... Oh, look, there's Floofty. Floofty's leg didn't grow back. They had to get a prosthetic after the bug snacks wore off. That's unfortunate for them, but I guess they don't really care. Going online, I'm assuming. Oh, you know what? No, Ella, uh, yeah. You know why everyone's going online? Because it's probably from uh, the Monster Hunter demo. Because a demo for the Sunbreak expansion just came out. I loved my time with Monster Hunter Rise on stream, and I really would love to play more of it, but I am nowhere near able to even play the DLC because it probably starts out way harder than anything I have uh, set up. Oh, hey, look! Philbo wins the election if you, uh, if you get everyone living. Nice, nice, nice. Yeah, it's just the Final Fantasy VII thing. The Nintendo Direct probably isn't going to be this week. Unless they announce it tomorrow for Thursday. It's it's not happening this week, unfortunately. I do think oh, it'll happen. Oh, I sent them away. It would be hard to make them disappear at this point. Do they suspect anything? Hmm, hard to say. Could be they're idiots. Could be they know the truth and they're keeping it quiet. Very well. We will have to keep our eye on them. Two quid, it does. Omne Vivamex Bug Snacks. Uh oh. Uh-oh. <laughs> Hind D. Yeah, that was very much a Metal Gear Solid uh, ending right there. So apparently that part is different if uh, you do the post-game area now. That was not worth going through the ending a second time. Hey, it's cool to it's cool to experience all this. I'm having fun with it, and we still got one more area to go, and then I can 100% it off stream if I really care about it. Also means I can finally finish watching Vinny stream of it now too. Talk to you. Oh, maybe I have to reset the day. Oh, wait, no, there we go. Uh, Chum, I need your help with a matter of grave importance. You see, my seismic readings have been off the charts today, and I fear something terrible is happening just off the coast. 
Chandler and I are headed to Simmering Springs to investigate, and I'd be greatly reassured if you could join us. Splendid! Meet us there whenever you get the chance. In the meantime, we have preparations to make. Chandler, ready the sunscreen! <laughs> Meet Snorpy in Simmering Springs. Shake it up. Nice night out. So apparently, this may not get me anything new, technically, but it will, uh... Sorby's concerned about the seismic readings he's found off the coast. I'm supposed to meet him with some experience to exist. It's just, this is... Is it There's still one bug snacks here I didn't find yet. That, that's a completely unknown. Oh yeah! I always wanted to have a beach party. Need me to sunscreen your back, Snorp Dog? No, no, no need, Chandlo. I'm well protected. I can tolerate the horrible sun for at least a few minutes. You sure? I could check if you missed a spot. <laughs> Best to keep our wits about us. This seismic event could happen any moment. Oh, oh, oh. It's the rumble. Oh, what was that? They're not usually this intense. An anomaly, to be sure. But it ended surprisingly quick. Oh, oh, oh. It's a new island, dog! We gotta go over there! How? Uh, must we? Uh, um, yes, uh, of course. Uh, but, but surely this job is bigger than the three of us. We need to form a miniature expedition. A gathering of our finest scientific minds. Of course, that means Triffany and... Floofty. Ooh, get Shelda, too! No. Shelda? Well, she's hardly qualified. You said you want the finest minds, and Shelda's loaded with wisdom. Bam! Team assembled. All right. Oh, I suppose she is an herbalist, and an herbalist. We have to a doctor without That's a weird way of around. reading that. Very well. Tell Triffany, Floofty, and Shelda to come to the beach. Chandler and I will stay here to prepare a way across. Ask Triffany to help with this. <laughs> I mean, I'm sure Roger Craig Smith was asked to read it that way, but it's still weird to see N herbologist. Why would you Why would you put the Why would you say N if you had if you if you're pronouncing the H? Ask Triffany to help investigate, and also ask Floofty and maybe Shelda. Maybe. See, I'm not sure there's any new. Uh, there's no new bug snacks. I know that. I think there's one. That gets added as like a bonus when you complete this, but I think the island itself uh, doesn't have any new bug snacks. If I missed any in the main game that are there, I'll I'm, I'll get them. But apparently, it's all just well, it's it's called the Isle of Big Snacks. That's the name of the update, so you could probably guess what's going to happen on there. These loading times. Damn these loading times. They're still better than the PS4 version, apparently. Also, I pointed this out at the end of the last... Not on stream, but to a couple people that were one asking about it. There is a Bunger plush, and uh, it will be coming back in stock on Fangamer at some point. I have myself set up to get notifications. There are strawberry plushes too, and those are in stock currently. Nothing like a campfire. You want to join our expedition? You're asking me? <clears throat> well, of course. Your need for guidance is great. Despite the peril, one will show you the path. 
and that scary little island. <laughs> if it's what I think it is, there's something there I need to see. Huh. Right. Another fine day behind us. Ah! Luke, I'm on fire. Help me. Help me. Being on fire is not scientific. Salutations. Hmm. So an unknown piece of geography has erupted from the ocean, unexplained and unstable, likely to sink again at any moment. Spent so of one. course <laughs> I'm going. I will gather my equipment. My girlfriend's uh, making a new costume, and one of the pieces for it that she wants is is a pair of Spamton glasses that she found on Etsy. Just as kind of like a little <sighs> joke. N nothing serious, but it's really cool. It's really funny. I'm very happy she has a good sense of humor. Where's, uh, Triffany? Alright. I'm gonna sleep till noon just so I can spawn Triffany. It always feels like one person just missing. Hey, how you doing? Oh, you better oh, believe I do. Islands don't just pop into being every day, you know. I got no business left here, so I'll go on ahead and meet you on the beach. Meet Snorpy and Simmering Springs. All right. Everybody's ready for the expedition. Ah, so soon. We're not quite ready yet. We could use another few days of assessment. What are you talking about, Snorp Dog? We got the raft ready in record time. Let's go get everybody. <sighs> of course, Chandlo. And you really don't want to talk Alrighty. to your sibling, do you? I'm here and ready to explore. <laughs> Ooh, she's just nice like, huh, I'm just gonna push this board there, over Chandler. here. Thanks, Brophany. Indeed. If it is not more than a finely crafted tomb, uh, everyone's just gonna the kick the board around, apparently. Wonders. Of course, Snorpington can get volunteers. Ah, oh, but it seems a vagrant has wandered into our expedition. Snacksburg is that way, Shelda. <gasps> Be still, your wicked tongue. One must show respect to one's elders. I will respect you as soon as you do something respectable. No, oh, you think so highly of yourself that you alone are they who can know the unknowable? Yes. No, you bring ruin to all that you touch. Ruin to Egabel, ruin to Elizabeth, ruin to your own flesh and blood. I'm starting to think this might not have been the best idea. You know, six folks is a lot for one raft. Maybe one of us ought to stay back home. Which one? Uh... We're all going. Me and Snorpy can hold it together. Actually, Chandlo, uh, well, I was thinking you and I should stay here and supervise. What? Bro. Why'd I build all this stuff if we're not going? Don't you want to know what's on the new island? Well, I, I, of course I do, but look at that thing. That island is a death trap. Come on, Snorp Dog. It's probably fine. Look, I gotta go out there. They need me. Yes, somebody needs to caddy the septuagenarian. Shut it. You can go if you must, Chandlu. But I'm staying here. But, bro, we do everything together. What if something happens to you while I'm gone? Me? Well, I'll be on this lovely beach. What if something happens to you? Yes, yes, you can both be struck by a meteor at any moment. Honestly, they do this every time Chen Lo goes to check the mail. 
Can we stop wasting time and get on with this expedition before I'm as old as Shelda? <clears throat> you two are like mirrors, reflecting endlessly. One must look away from the infinite abyss and gaze down only at oneself. What? <gasps> Far be it for me to give anyone life advice, but there's nothing wrong with a little time apart. It's healthy, even. All right. If you all say so. Don't worry. I'll be in radio contact the entire time. And I've got trackers on at least three of you. Right. Okay. Then let's get this party started! Noises of disparate enthusiasm. I'll let you do the honors. Just jump on the raft when you're ready. Oh, it's okay, Chandlo. Snorpy's gonna be fine. Time apart is healthy. All right, chum, if worse comes to worst and you're surrounded by grumpinati agents, shout the code word and I will set off a flashbang hidden somewhere on your body. Don't worry, Where? it should be perfectly safe as long as you don't say the code word at any other time. Good luck. What's the code word? If one is fated to brave a den of inevitable tragedy, one would prefer to do so in better company. This group is a little uh, volatile, but I'm sure we can put our differences aside for the Banana. sake of learning. Yeah? Broccoli! It was broccoli! As usual, it is up to me to do a majority of the heavy thinking around here. Let us not be distracted by interpersonal dramatics when a cacophony of scientific curiosities has been dropped in our laps. The first curiosity is why are, why are your shadows so jagged? Crust, yeah. Broken tooth. So this has a new achievement tied to it, if you complete this area. More like broken dreams, no. I mean, this game is very bittersweet, and I'm not just talking about the bittersweet tasting bug snacks. Definitely seems like even in the best case scenario, one's lives are just kind of like, whatever. They got it, we got it, we got to rebuild. Snorp Dog, we made it to the other island. We found some kind of reef cove thing to land on. Chandlo, listen to me, it's very important. You need to understand that remote detonator. What? Snorpy! Oh, Grump, the radio's broken. No, no, I think we're just out of range. Or there could be some interference going on. Oh, how unfortunate. I suppose we will have to proceed without Snorpington's so-called supervision. But maybe we should go back and tell him? It'll only take an hour. The threshold is crossed. It cannot be uncrossed. And if you think I'm spending another minute on that plank of wood today, <laughs> you are dead wrong. Yeah, you're always right, Shelda. Snorpy knows we got this. He'd want us to keep exploring. Huh. Looks like there's a way across up there. Let's check it out, bro. <laughs> All right, Crown Tundra, here we are. New assignment, light the way. No, sorry, this is the Isle of Armor. The Crown Tundra will be the next update. <laughs> Despite one's years, there ever remains a sense of humbling beauty where sand meets sea, and not a toxin in sight. Yeah, I have a bad feeling that's not gonna last. Hmm. These coral structures are the only animal species I've witnessed anywhere near the Snacktooth biosphere. Intriguing. I guess bug snacks wouldn't technically be considered an animal, huh? Trout. 
two steps onto this island and I'm already seeing evidence of ancient Grumpus technology. Oh, this trip is definitely gonna be worth it. Activate the bridge across the cove. Okay. Ah, all right. Do we need to light that thing up? I bet Snorpy's trip shot could do it. Do you think Snorpy can see us from the beach? I can't really see him, but he's got those thick lenses, so I bet he totally could. Got some niece. I got some Niso Sh Nissan Shio ramen. It looked fancy as food. That sounds good. I did get sushi after the last time I streamed Bug Snacks, and it was uh, it was delish. Nice. Last one across is a rotten eggler. Philbo wants to talk. What? No. What? I I don't like how it's gonna keep. Defaulting to that. Okay, so you can fast travel between Broken Tooth and the other areas. That's good. Also, what? This didn't stick. Dude, the main story of Bugs Next didn't stick. Also, neither did Survivor. That's weird. Did it just not get saved? That must be a glitch. Well, would you look at that? Some kind of ancient maze carving. With moving parts and everything. Well, whoever built it put it directly in our way. Chandler, you excel in brute force. Destroy this. You got it, floof dog! Call me Floof Dog again and see what happens. Now hold on, hold on there. Let's not go smashing the priceless antiques just yet. Looks like you could fit your buggy ball down there in the entrance. I bet if we solve this maze, something real interesting is gonna happen. <laughs> yeah, maybe. Whoa, this thing's like a super huge old pinball machine. Dibs on the next game, bro. Yes, yes, how impressive. Some very dead grumpuses figured out how to move rocks up and down. Please solve this so that we can find something interesting. Oh, that's close enough, it's me so. That's odd. Mm. Somehow big puzzles didn't make it into the stories. <laughs> <clears throat> ah, but what a wonder it is to behold the divine workings of one's ancestors. Gosh. This thing's been waterlogged for a thousand years, and somehow the parts are all still moving. <gasps> Wish my husband was that reliable. One thousand and two spikes. All this time, not to mention the water damage. <laughs> That's just the door. Who knows what historical goodies we'll find inside there? I got that game on 3DS when I watched Vinny play it, and uh, it was a buggy mess on the 3DS. They actually updated it like a couple, like a year down the road, that made it on on par with the PC version. That game is a ball buster. Ooh, look at this place. Whoa! It's a jungle out there! 
Oh, goodness. To think that this whole valley was underwater not that long ago. I can even see evidence of civilization from who knows when. Oh, check out that impressive looking temple up there. One is more concerned with the ominous crater that lies beneath. If my eyes do not deceive me, I believe I've spotted new varieties of bug snacks as well. New bug snacks? Sick! Think they could be dangerous? There's an easy way to find out. Well, uh, before we get too ahead of ourselves, we might want to set up a base camp. A wonderful idea. One could use time to... Ah, uh, recenter. Five minutes in, and you already need a nap. Leave the labor to the protective members of society, then. Oh, please don't start this again. Rose! Come check this out! You seeing what I'm seeing? It's Bunger time! Excellent. Why don't you go and fetch it for us, Chen Lo? Way ahead of you, dog! Oh, dear. You better go follow and help him yep. out. We'll stay it's, up it's here the and big, start setting up It's the Big Mac. <laughs> big Bunger. Big Bungus. If what Shelda has to say is so monumentally important, then why does she waste time making her speech so farcically obtuse? Employing sesquipedalian jargon is rudimentary. The hard part is make brain no big think. Oh. Okay, that that is um that is rather uh, hypocritical, but okay. Gosh, from the moment they met, Floofy and Shelda sure have hated each other. As I recall, Shelda said, "Greetings, child," and Floofy said, "It is unlikely we are related by blood. Therefore, I am not your child." And things kind of escalated from there. Bunger One wonders Royale. at every second what revelation this accursed land could possibly contain that would be worth suffering a mere ten minutes with Floofty. Not a grumpin' thing, that's what. A grumpin' thing, that's what. Good job, Floofty, yeah. Now that's a Bunger. Is it just me? Or is that Bunger way... Oh! Bunger Royale, it's a bunger, but big. There's always a bigger bunger. Oh, okay, they do consider these separate, uh, separate bug snacks. Whoa, whoa, a little laggy there. And my bones! Where am I? I hit some kind of statue room? Looks like she's holding a thing. I don't know what that is, but try throwing it at the big bunger. Maybe that'll do something. Icky paint like goop. Alright, so essentially the plot of this is big big meat, make small meat, and then catch meat. It does count as a new stack though. Bunger. And that comes with super tater tots. Alright, bro. You got bunger? I got hunger. Now bunger me, bro! Bunger, bunger Royale coming up, buddy. Yeah! Oh, 
was terrible. So good! That's a whole meal in one bite! We gotta tell the others about this! Plus, I should probably help unpack. You... Did you all see that? Giant bug snacks! Even the bungers out here are as big as Mama Melon! Looks like a pretzel. Yes. Yeah, we got a bun. We might witness a prehistoric species somehow preserved at the bottom of the ocean. Ocean? Uh -huh. That would align with my theory on the correlation between age and size. The lost sister of Snacktooth lies unburied. Yet you marvel at the engorgement of the toxins that dance on her grave. The lost what now? Tell me, Chenlo. How did you come to capture this specimen? We found a jar of some kind of small dust. It came out of this old lady statue thing. A statue, eh? What did it look like? Like a big friendly grumpus lady with flowers all around her. Uh, no. That sounds like it could be a shrine to Mother Nature, eh? Whoa. Shelda, that's your thing. No, 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 no. Ah, but why would Mother Nature, no to despiser of bug snacks, be dispensing bug snack catching equipment? Hmm? Shelda, your god is a hypocrite. Uh -oh. Silence, you wretch. The wretch. mother shines. The mother protects. Wretch. If you so doubt, then one will wield the light of truth against your blasphemy. <laughs> okay, then. I guess Shelda's gonna go check out those shrines. Uh, meanwhile, I gotta go take a look at all the ruins around oh, here. Ruins. There's so much ancient history to uncover. I'm giddy just thinking about it. Don't you know? I am fascinated by this shrink spice and its effects on snack matter. If I can determine exactly what it's made of, I'm certain we will have much use for it. So we all right, someone Rose. Eat me. I know I'm not a scientist, but I got a hypothesis. If this island can make Big Bunger, can it make Big Chandlo? Can it make That's Big Chungus? not what a hypothesis is. Honestly, what does my brother see in you? Oh, hush. I'm sure it's worth a try. Well <laughs> then, let's get to it. Island time. Help Triffany, help Floofty, help Chandlo, help Shelda. Alright, Floofty. Okay. Time to, uh, change your look. That looks weird because they're just textures. Yeah, that's cool. Do anything I wouldn't. Don't do anything you wouldn't. Change of scenery is always nice. Shelda. I don't really like how that looks. What if I made you all cheese? Doesn't make your face look better. She has become Ritz. She's gone full Ritz. Actually, no. She's she likes all natural stuff. Here we go. There you go. Enjoy being plant. As for you, Chanlo. Melon Boy. I like how you could still feed her through the purification box. Okay, who do we want to help first? Ancient Flare, a stone brazier set up by the ancient Grumpuses to easily spread fire. The trip shot can fire up the top. 
Tikata Masala patrols the nest around the Trosirian's nest, keeping a lookout for eggless shells. The flying fiend's fire is so hot that it will ignite the very air within your lungs. Oh, that or I have heartburn. Hates, uh, someone. Breakable wall. I didn't even notice that was a breakable wall. Box of purity. Shelter claims any bug snacks placed in this box will be purified by the light of mother. Sure. Flifty science tro. The tro where Flifty keeps their science, apparently. <laughs> what do you want to investigate? Bro, I gotta see if eating these big bug snacks will make me Big Chandlo. Oh man, you'd be my I new favorite this character. Huge snack lifting stuff near the river. Big lifting? You know I gotta get me some of that. <laughs> Catch one clobsteroni. That sounds like a new one completely. Rolling, it bowls through anything in its path. A nightmare of every archaeologist oh, it's seafood mac and cheese. Big cheese. Millie Mochi, it travels in a line with its friends, leaping it and leaping it and freezing anything that crosses its path. It seems to change color and flavor based on its emotion. I'm curious at what happiness tastes like. I'm not a huge fan of mochi. Whoa. Giant egg eggler shell. An egg shell far too big to carry and tough enough to protect from other bug snacks. There must be a way to crack it open. Whoa, when did Eggabel get here? Ancient egg cracker. Perfectly designed to crack a big egg. The tiki masala seems to use it as a nest. Nest. The tea. <laughs> Look at this guy busting my balls. Uh, balls. I have two. Oh, look at this. Breakable wall. Speaking of balls, it kind of looks like balls. Clopsteroni. Trampoline, an ancient an ancestor to the launch pad, with less control but more bounce. Clopsteroni, strong enough to lift other Whoa. bug snacks as well as its beloved Whoa. trampoline. Whoa. I bet I could lift that trampoline. Ooh, okay, that's interesting. That unlocked. Is it hot there? Uh, yes. It was like 90 degrees today. I did not go outside, but I know it was, it was rather hot. Chocolate Lant grows when exposed to the open air. Likes to play keep away with his fellow Chocolate Lants. Like all bullies, they become cowardly when shrunk. Ah, shrink stuff's over there. Can I just carry shrink stuff from over here, though? Like the path is blocked off. Mm. 
Bunga Royale. It's interesting that they don't seem to really care. Ninety. It's supposed to be seventy-one there tomorrow. All right, wait, 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 wait let me check. Let's check here. It is currently sixty-eight. Tomorrow, it is going to reach a high of eighty-two. Okay, so it's not too bad. It's gonna be cloudy. Thursday, rain, eighty-two. Friday, thunderstorms, ninety-one, and then it's gonna be eighties the following week. High eighties. Yeah, it's gonna be kind of toasty. And I'm going to Pittsburgh. In another two weeks, and uh, Pittsburgh, if I recall, is is very very warm. It can get very hot there very quickly at the beginning of July. Oh wait a minute. Loves chocolate. Hold on. Still hovering here a bit cold. Summer weather is usually start to mid July around the PNW. Fungus our way over here. No! Wrong. Spice, a strange smoking powder will temporarily shrink gigantic bug snacks. Okay. Holla, holla, get dollar. Texture. Clobsteroni over there. Nut. 
Oh, I found another voice. I found another clip. If I if I get if I get a good uh, soundboard going on. Oh my God, Gamma, fucking. <laughs> I, I know I know of another sound bite I want I want on a soundboard if I can ever get one going up and running here. Damn it, where is it? I just retweeted a clip of it today. Here it is. Some nice friends you got there, Davis. Some nice friends you got there, Davis. I want to get that and like base boosted or some shit. <laughs> when the, I'll, I'll play that when people raid me. So, some nice friends you got there, Davis. Because someone retweet someone retweeted that scene again today, but they they kept in the part afterwards where he kicks the ball. And they do like the they, they do like the motion blur of his of his like image just moving past Davis. And any, anytime someone posts that video, they say, they'll they'll say "nice friends you got there." Davis is one word, but like in very small text. Oof, oofta. All right. Uh, burp. Excuse me. Hmm. Is there a torch I can reach? Oh, uh, yeah. Okay. There's a torch over there. Do these tor these torches stay lit, right? Whoa. Get huge. Oh, this is my favorite quest. I still haven't watched uh, Last Evolution yet. For uh, Digimon. I really should. I want to finish up the, uh, the whole try, uh, thing. Oh. energy inside me but I didn't get bigger at all I guess I didn't get huge eating that big bunger either you know what bro I'm just gonna admit to myself that it's not gonna work and move on guess that means my investigations over already what do I do now challenge all the bug snacks to fight bro if I can't handle big bunger I don't stand a chance against the rest. Goals for the future, maybe. You want to read Lock the Superman, but that ain't happening likely for now. I haven't even heard of that. I'm already helping where I can, bro. But I'm not a scientist. Floofty said if I touched their lab again, they'd give me an excoriating worthy of my fatuity. Just sit back and relax. Relax, huh? I guess it's been a while since I just chilled. I've been so busy, fixing up Snacksburg, training, life coaching, and, you know, I've always got to take care of Snorpy. What the grump? Let's hang! We ought to shoot some hoops! Let's shoot hoops. Wait, All what? right! Hoops, 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 hoops! You just want to get huge part two. You know the rules, dog. We're going to take turns shooting hoops. First one to make five baskets wins. Okay. Go ahead and shoot your first shot. Oh. 
you got one point. I mean, it helps that I My have turn. a throwing arc. <laughs> nice one point. That's two points for you, bro. My turn. <laughs> Grunt of effort. Two points for me. Three points, dog. My turn. <laughs> Grump, I missed. You got four points. My turn. <laughs> I got three points. I'm just really enjoying this. Whoa, five points. You won, dog. I didn't know you were such a baller. We gotta have a rematch sometime. Thanks for playing with me, bro. Now that we're done hanging, I gotta get back to Snacksburg. I gotta go check on Snorpy. Snorpy's doing fun on the beach. You sure about that, dog? One time I saw Snorpy lose a fight with a crapple. But that's not the point. Oh, bro, I'm gonna be real with you. This is the longest I've been away from Snorpy in years. And he's not okay without me. How about this? I'm gonna need some big energy for the trip back. You get me two of the biggest, strongest bug snacks on this island. And I'll stick around till I'm fueled up. Get huge part three, okay. Or a basketball rematch. No, I'm out. good. One... Pylobite and Selly Sticks. I don't even know what those are. <laughs> oh, Warm up that thing over there. It does look like most of the torches stay lit. going on with me right now. Everything is okay with me mentally. No, cheese, go away. Most of the uh that bug snack down there? No. Oh, there's an X on that one, that's interesting. Oh, is the, is the goal here not to be caught or get sent back here? Ah, yes. 
It's all coming together. Pylobite. Its protective cover deflects shrink spice. The snack grappler would help remove it. Fascinating. This cover appears to be some form of crystallized snack matter. Ancient flare. This pillar seems to represent leaders of the past. Oh, there's a... A uh, campfire over there. Triangle key, a strange triangular key. What sort of space might this open? A strange triangular key. I see. There's multiple tabs on it. It's a pie. Celly sticks so big that it unknowingly carries smaller bug snacks on its back. Better, I'd like it better with grape mosquitoes, but you do you. Also, half never mind. I might be able to read some of it after all. Nice. Oh, there's more up here. I see. So it'll take more to defeat you. Huh. It's vulnerable to shrink spice, so clearly you have a taste. <laughs> Spaghetti pulls its prey into ca into the canopy with its noodles. Never don't look up. Well, I need these two. Burn it with fire. I need shrink spice before I can catch either of them, though. That's kind of the rub here. Is 
there any sign of fire that I could use up here to get over there? There's already a thing over- okay, wait, 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 wait. There's a trampoline down there. Cheesy glob, this pile of cheese and noodle bits is evidence of a bug snack. It appears to have left the immediate area, but it's still nearby. Also, what is it? Raisins on its back? I think it's other... Yeah, I don't know. So I have to find a way to get this... this thing here. You hate celery, it tastes like pennies. Oh, that's terrible. I love celery. You don't like ants on a log? Celery with uh, raisins? Peanut butter, okay, who reacts to peanut butter? That thing. Fuck no, aw. Food is that? You never understood that. I think it's good. I like it. Is there any way that I might be able to? No. Wait. Can I maybe? I could push it. Push it real good, but I can't. Uh. Wait a minute, wait a minute, wait a minute, wait, 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 My brain is doing a big... No. Never mind. Like, silly cooked, but just raw by itself? Nope. I prefer raw vegetables to cooked. Okay, wait. Now, maybe if I... Nudge it... going how I want it to. I got a letter. I should have to go back and read it. Hop up. Bop, bop, bop. You and I have very different tastes in food. I could probably just go down there and get more spice. But then I won't solve the mystery of how to get over there. Also, man, this moth takes forever to come back on the, over here. Cheese and noodle piles, evidence of a bug snack. First of all, left the immediate area, but it's still nearby. It's it's the noodler, not the noodler. It's the it's the, 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 the seafood macaroni. But how do I get it back? Wait, what's over here? What is this? Hold up. There we go. Lobsteroni. Uh, loves hot sauce. Okay. No, oh, come on, man. I left you stuff to follow. Oh, 
There we go. That's a good boy. Alright. Give me that bounce. Okay. If I just grab this and uh, shrink ya, do ya? Oh, it's chocolate lance. Once you shrink them, it's easy to get them. Get huge part three. We're about to finish that. Okay, what else? He okay, there's a breakable wall there. Big mysterious door. There appears to be spots here to fill in, and there appear to be no. Can't really walk up that. Like I could somehow see the box of purity from here. Wait a minute, there's three circles. Does that mean I have to get one of these mochi pieces in each one? Oh, that's gonna be a pain. Millie, 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 Millie,
Oh, they can't break that. Okay. Or can they? They don't seem to be going for it. There they go. Bunger Royale. Okay. Yep, we've gone in a circle. So we've, we've, we've finished up everything here in terms of exploring. Well, outside that spot in the middle, but it requires a little more work. How are we doing on bug snacks here? We've caught uh, 5 out of 11. Yeah. Makes sense. Mm -hmm. Before I go, I need some major guidance. Normally, there's stuff I can't talk about because Snorpy's always listening in. So, if not now, when? Let's get you some guidance, buddy. All right, Sheldon's waiting. <laughs> Give Chandler some life hey, advice. Hey, Sheldog, can I get some of your wisdom? Always, my child. I'm worried about Snorpy. Once more shall you be reminded. Snorpy is safer than we, Chandlo. Ease your burden. That's... that's not what I mean. I'm worried about the way he's been. All the paranoid stuff, the anxiety. I thought bringing Snorpy out here, out into nature, it might mellow him out. Flush all the bad vibes out of his system. But it's only gotten worse. I've known Snorpy all my life. But it feels like he's getting further away from me, and, and I just don't know what to do. Uh, one must, in the path of the mother, no, uh, hold on. One does not want one's words to be misinterpreted when one says, that boy needs therapy. Well, yeah, yeah, for sure. <laughs> and I'm trying to do that. I make sure he's safe, I listen to his problems, I try to help him feel valid, all that stuff. Chandlo, you are strong and wise and wonderful, and you can do everything to support him. But you cannot fix him. Understand? Snorpy is lost in a maze of his own making, and it will take a professional to help him escape. That's a lot to take in. I need to think about it. Thanks for your wisdom, Shelda. You yeah, thank me when you actually take my advice. Hey, bro. While I'm still out here, I want to talk to Triffany and Floofty, too. There's still more I gotta know, you know? I don't feel like talking to Floofty's getting. Oh, whatever. Ask Triffany to talk to Chan Lo. Oh, I'm happy to chat with Chan Lo. Let's meet by the campfire. Don't you know? What's going on, Chandlo? Trithany, you know about history and, like, ancient societies and stuff. Shelda said Snorpy's lost in a maze of delusion. But what if it's not a delusion? What if there really is a Grumpinati? Well, I've done some research on my own, and uh, near as I can tell, there's no such thing. At least not in the way you see in the movies. There's no shadowy cabal secretly in control of the world. Yeah, just don't tell that to my Real prior boss. can't happen. And heck, there was an old literary society called the Grumpinati, but aside from the name, it's not at all what Snorpy talks about. <laughs> Are you sure? I mean, I've seen Snorpy's charts and 
They kind of make sense. Kinda. Kinda is the important word here, though. Look, there are points of data on that chart that are real, but it's all those strings between them that are made up. No, those are real. We got them from Gramble. That's not what she means. Oh, Chandlo, that's not, uh, what I... Up, 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 let it go, my child. Point is, Snorpy might be a talented engineer, but he's no historian, and he's certainly not immune to bias, you know? Yeah, look at his sibling. Yeah, I guess you're right. I hope you're right. Thanks for talking to me, Triff Dog. No problem. And if you ever want to know more about failed conspiracies throughout history, you know where to find me. <laughs> Channel wants to talk to you. Oh, I suppose it was only a matter of time. Tell Channel I will be with him shortly. Are we here to speak ill of my brother? I will gladly go first. Complaint one of 294. <laughs> no, no, that's not why I asked you here. But I do want to talk about Snorpy. He wasn't like this when we were kids, right? I mean, he wasn't always so on edge, was he? Snorpington has always had his imagination and his moral compass. But no, I suppose he's gotten markedly more distraught since our project's dissolution. What happened between you two? I mean, I heard some of it from him, but I always wanted to hear your side, too. And Snorpy doesn't really like me talking to you. Oh, I'm aware. I have a pile of threatening letters to that effect. However, I will gladly take this opportunity to set the record straight. We were working together on a government-funded research project. Advanced prosthetics that are ten times stronger than an ordinary grumpus. I wonder if that's what they had but on at the end of the game. Snorpington discovered back. that the government had less than savory plans for that technology. And despite my protestations, he tried to make those plans public knowledge. Well, yeah, I don't blame him. Even you got to admit, that's pretty jacked up, dog. Am I the world's there. only optimist? That technology would have saved lives. If it must either exist with some consequences or not exist at all, I think the choice is clear. Easy to say when you aren't the one living with the consequences. Yeah, <laughs> where did you come from? Yeah. <sighs> Unfortunately, Snorpington <laughs> agreed with you. He tried to play whistleblower, but before he could make a sound, we were both fired. And after that, there was a campaign to slander both of us, to discredit any allegations he might still make. So, there really was a conspiracy against you two? <laughs> if you must call it that. But only the most boring sort with paperwork and lawsuits. Still, that means it's not all in his head. Don't mistake justification for reason. Snorpicton has moved well beyond the realities of our situation. All right, Flifty. Thanks for telling me all that. Mm, happy to have enlightened you. Honestly, I expected this conversation to involve more shouting and headlocks. No, not this time. We're cool. But hey, we should talk more often. And maybe I can show you how to headlock me! Perhaps. But for now, my work beckons. You're ish fritter because of cute Annie Boo boys. Were you making that sound that Flufty just made? Yeah. What are you gonna do now? Bro, I feel like there's a huge weight on top of me, and it's not the kind I can lift. Snorpy never would have come to Snack Tooth if I didn't push him into it. All I do now is make him exercise and ignore all the stuff I don't understand. Sheldon's right. I don't know enough to really help him, and thinking I do is only making it worse. I'm gonna stay here. Until everybody's ready, anyway. I need some time to just think. And shoot some hoops. One time, I stayed an extra hour at the gym, and Snorpy reported me missing. And I guess he also rigged the apartment with booby traps. I got hit with paint cans ten times just trying to open the front door. I mean, I was okay, but our landlord was pretty mad. Yeah. Let's 
do Triffany next. Actually, no, let's do Sheldon next. What do you want to investigate? One must see what lies within those supposed shrines to Mother Nature. Not shrines destroyed and forgotten, but one untouched by the ravages of time. I think I've opened most of them. One can see it up along the river's path. That is the place we must meet. Mercifully, the path is free of obstacles. One thanks you for your devotion. Oh, I've, I've probably already the done some of this. Once more revealed, and yet no less treacherous. One's heart is filled with dread for the truths yet unknown within the River Shrine. Nevertheless, we must push forward. <laughs> Have faith. With the shrine, now what? Oh, thanks for meeting me out here. I guess if it's just you and me, <laughs> I can keep it casual. Oh, the front entrance to this place looks too strenuous for these old bones. But I believe there's a side entrance into the shrine. When you find it, can you please open it for me? Oh, right, there's a breakable wall in there that I don't know where it is or how to break it. I have to go, I have to get it from over there somehow. It's almost identical to the shrines I used to visit in my youth. But it's been twisted, corrupted. Here, Mother Nature is the bringer of bug snacks. The stories they passed down, the warnings about the toxin, they must have come from experience. The shrines of your youth? Yes, the place where I learned about the beauty and wisdom of this world. I hear it's a parking lot now. <laughs> Was this the mother's original form? <gasps> no. The mother is of purest light. Her ageless wisdom vastly predates these vile monstrosities. But her followers are a different story. No one starts life on the path. That's why we all need guidance. What stories? I grew up hearing stories about the dangers of Snacktooth Island, passed down through the oral tradition from those who survived it. Not that many did survive it. Just enough to give one very clear message. The toxin must not be consumed. Do you ever find something so cool to you and you want to talk about it, but you know no one will care nor understand what you're talking about? Yes, that's why I stream. So people have to listen to me talk about it. No. Um, yeah, no, all the time. I mean, it sucks when you have, like, a hyperfixation and no one cares, but I've also been on the other end of the of that where people will tell me theirs, and I'm like, I don't really care about this, but I'll listen just to be nice. It's kind of a weird balancing act, you know? I think the best thing is not to take it personally when someone isn't super interested. Why not consume the toxin? Because it will lead to your doom. What doom? I, I do not know. The story's gotten frustratingly vague over time. Why didn't you tell us this? Oh, I did! 
every day at the top of my lungs. It's all of you who didn't listen. Why did you come here? It wasn't really a raffle, I can tell you that. <sighs> come with me to the crater. There's something else I want to see. Meet Shelda in the crater. That's you right now? I'm sorry. Is it about the, uh, the, the manga you were talking about? What are we looking for? Yes, this is the place. In the stories, they call this island Broken Tooth. So the story goes, the toxin's influence grew so great and powerful that the sun itself went dark. And so Mother Nature unleashed her oh, wrath on her errant followers, purging the toxin and sending everything to the depths of the ocean. This crater is the Mother's Wrath? Looks a lot like wrath to me. But that story never sat right with me. Destroying followers who stray? That isn't the mother I know. She's not the bringer of bug snacks either. The ancients can't even get their story straight. So what am I supposed to believe? If I can't rely on the wisdom of those past, then all that's left is my own experience. I need to meditate. Child, if you would do me a kindness. You see that egg, Lachelle? I need you to crack open three of them. This time, it's not a metaphor. How do I move these? Oh, I could just, hold on. Uh, it's just a bunch of dots and stuff, not that I don't think you'd be interested. Well, just tell me after the stream. I'll be around. Deviled Eggler. Egglers with wings and aggressive tendencies. They attach their a bit runny. You'll have to poach them before they scramble. Is there a door over there? No, that's just rocks. Interesting, it's a triangle. Runny eggs, I love them a bit runny. I like deviled eggs. Taking it. Yes. Come on. Ugh. I can tell since you do talk about them a bit here and there. Oh, deviled eggs? Yeah. We usually make them for holidays and stuff. No! Okay, that's two. Where's the third one? Oh, it's in the shrine. That's right. I remember now. shrine over here.
I just realized the shells even have the pattern on it. Shells. Oh, thank you. I know that wasn't an easy task. Ah, bugs necks are so often in the shape of unliving things, but somehow these shells are just shells. <laughs> They're also the only good source of calcium on this island. But, but, but don't judge me. <laughs> I'm fighting osteoporosis. Ah, <sighs> anyway, I've centered my thoughts. I want to know for myself what bug snacks are. Whether they're of the mother or not, I'm going to need that big old nasty flying bug snack. Please, bring it to the box of purity when you get the chance. Oh yeah, you need it, alright. Have faith, part three. Alright, there it is. Hot sauce, okay. Okay, I just need to get the shrinky dink. Snack in the box. Thank you. I swear I'm not going to eat it this time. Nay, for I seek the very essence of bug snacks. That spirit which drives them to create their poisonous delights. Unfortunately, I have no grump and clue how to do that. You could ask Floofty. <gasps> Floofty? Are you out of your grumping mind? One would never consult with that Wicked alchemist. You said you wanted to learn. Yes, one wants to learn. Not to receive long-winded insults. But, one must admit, when it comes to delving into the Forbidden, there is none more bold than Floofty. Oh, well, if that is how it must be, then may the Mother protect me. Huh. Shelda, you seem to be dangerously close to my personal space. If you're here to trap me in a spell circle again, I will inform you that I could leave at any time and I was merely acting. Temper your contemptuous heart. One is here on a quest for understanding, to unlock the forbidden knowledge of bug snacks. Oh, and you've come to me. Why don't you ask your mother naturally? Or crystal, or whatever you talk to. The path is shrouded at the moment. One believes that clearing this impasse requires a more scientific lens. Oof. How interesting. Are you certain? I'm given to understand that I exude a fetid odor of utter evil from every pore. You are reckless and arrogant and so, so rude. And I hate you. But one does not truly believe that you are evil. <laughs> well, I have little time nor patience for your games. If you want to know something, 
Stop speaking like a horoscope and ask. Ugh. I want to know the essence of bug snacks. What is it they're made of? If I can understand that, then I might know whether they're actually separate from Mother Nature, eh? or born from the darkness of her history. I'm not about to resolve your philosophical quandaries. There is no answer to the why of the universe. Bug snacks simply exist. However, since you've finally taken an interest in my studies, then just this once I will educate you. I can show you how to extract live snack matter for microscopic viewing without that matter denaturing. Hmm. Ah, but if I were to explain it to a very small infant, denaturing is... I know what denaturing means. You do? I'm here to learn about bug snacks, not vocabulary. Ah, uh -huh. yeah, very well then. Our lesson should proceed smoothly. Step one of 17, preparing an adequate formalin solution. Thank you for encouraging this old lady to learn something new. Now you better leave us to it. I sense this may take a while. Complete. Well, you don't hate them, but... Bug snacks are but one of many of the mother's toxins to take root among the Tooth Islands. Gramble found that out the hard way when he tried to eat the lupins. Take it from an herbalist. Almost everything here is secretly poison. Oh, she didn't eat the, uh, the thing. That was actually all of hers. Okay, gonna help Triffany. What'd you want to investigate? Oh, thank goodness you're here. I'd say it's high time we get to exploring. I see another maze blocking the way deeper into the jungle. Yeah, I already took care of I that. I bet if we solve it, we'll find something real exciting. I'll go ahead and make my way over to the maze. Meet me there when you're ready for some puzzling. <laughs> Sick. Sorry, just a moment. Or, you know, find something dark as fuck, yeah. Clearing out some messages here. I have one of my sites, one of my uh, accounts on a site, just had like a ton of spam shit. Okay, meet Miss Triffany by the maze door. All right, uh, which which maze door? Nice to be away from the others for a minute. The arguing can be, uh, distracting, you know? Trouble with Shelda? Oh, well, I think Shelda's got a lot to teach us. It's just exhausting to get a real answer out of her. Then she can be, uh, head judgmental. Gosh, I don't know. I feel like I ought to be taking more of a leadership role out here. But I do all my best work when I'm alone. <clears throat> Anywho, no use dwelling on that. Looks like you went and solved that maze before I could even get here. Yeah, I know, I'm pretty oh, epic. Let's go inside, scan around, and see just what kind of ruin this is. <laughs> scan clues in the underground chamber. Large bonfire. This huge fire must have kept the cave system warm. Recesses where a large number of grumpuses slept. Communal beds. Okay, yeah. He speed ran the maze. It's more like I just had time to do it. Or it was just in my way. In my way. In my way.
cave in to seal the chamber beyond here. Checked out these ruins. Judging by what we've seen, I'd say this was a communal living space. One of the few that wasn't utterly destroyed anyway. And gosh, technology and culture are so much more advanced than what we've seen so far. This city must have been the center of Stone Grumpus society. And at the very center, the temple, possibly led by a priestess of Mother Nature. Why the mazes? Hmm, that's a great question. There's definitely easier ways to lock a door. <laughs> but seeing as this was the height of their craftsmanship, it's possible they built those mazes just to show off. <laughs> Tell me about Mother Nature and Nature. I don't know too much, but I'll say it's one of the world's oldest practice and religions. I'm sure Shelda could tell you more about it. But on that subject, it's odd I never saw hide nor hair of Mother Nature back on Snacktooth. It's possible she showed up relatively late in their culture, adding to the existing worship of bug snacks. Should we explore the temple? Oh, I thought you'd never ask. Never look a gift temple in the gateway, as Grandma used to say. <laughs> I'll meet you by the entrance, yeah? Meet Triffany by the temple entrance. What's with that face? I don't know what I don't know what you're so freaking you're freaking out about there. Just because I said the phrase in, in my way a bunch of times. Here, how do we open the temple? Oh, hey! You can see the camp from up here. At a nice, safe distance. Anywho, there should be a mechanism oh. here that'll get us through that door. Might be a bit of a jog, though. Okay. Well, that makes things a lot. I thought I was gonna have to use the actual mochis here to fill in those slots or something. Oh, this is a big maze. Way to go! That was some fancy footwork. Oh, wow. Okay, this time the ancient architects were definitely showing off. But you know, this ludicrously complex maze tells me that whatever's in the temple beyond is just that important. So you know the drill. Let's get to solving. <laughs> hmm. Wow, they actually put the flame out there. Wow, this is such a neat way of, like, utilizing this in a new, fun method. Can I just put the ball, like, right here? Oh, wait a minute. Like, what's stopping me from just dropping the ball in here? This is not a Plinko game, yeah. Chocolate, 
Chocolant says its name with the same rhythm as as the Reese's Puff song. This, I see now. We're getting into a little bit of a uh, rough territory here. Oh, this, this is a pain. Okay. Definitely Barbara Goodson uh, doing that voice. All right, and then we just need to get over here. Nice job! You know, it took all my willpower not to just jump in and do it myself. Anywho, the way is open, so let's get going. <laughs> I crushed my ball. Collapsed skeleton. This unfortunate corpse seems to have been crushed by falling boulders thousands of years ago. That's a kick in the teeth. So much. You don't want that to happen. Your teeth are made of food right now. Judging break by them. the bodies, this collapse must have happened when folks were still living here. Maybe the crater is connected somehow. Come to think of it, we didn't find a single corpse back in the commune. Where'd all those grumpuses get to? Well then, I'm not about to let this mystery go unsolved. I've just got to roll up my sleeves and clear this rubble myself. Shouldn't we ask the others for help? Oh, no. No, we don't need to trouble everybody with all this. I know my way around ruins. I'll be just fine on my own. You just leave this to me. Go on about your day, and I'll have it done in a gif, okay? It's pronounced gif. All right. That's how one gets stuck, yeah. Have a good one. That's a good one.
Hi. Ow. Ow. The bone stopped the bullet. You should go to the hospital after Pi. We dueling here or what? Oh, sorry. Where were my manners? Look with the rubble. Oh, it's not going too good. I'm starting to worry I might never see the inside of this temple. Maybe Flufty could figure something out. No one them. They go and whip up some chemical that dissolves rocks and only takes three fourths of their blood to make. It's safer for them if I don't ask. Maybe Sheldon knows a secret way in. I could be, but I don't know that I need even more riddles to solve. Besides. I've heard the sounds her back makes. She could really use a lie down. Maybe Chandler could push through. I don't know. Maybe he could. But if I put him in any danger, Snorpy's gonna hear about it. And then I'll hear about it every day for the rest of my life. Maybe they could all work together to open it. Oh, I was afraid you'd say that. <clears throat> sure. Teamwork would really help out here. But those grumps can't go more than an hour without starting a big fight, and I, uh, I just freeze up. You know, I'm an expert in my field and all, but I'm not a management type. It's better if I just concentrate on my work and let them cool off on their own. You really don't think they could cooperate? To be honest, no, I don't. These kind of spats, they just fester and grow, and before you know it, Civilization My, uh, collapses. Controllers rumbling. Look, some folks just don't get along. Some mysteries just go unsolved. There's nothing I can really do about it. Let me guess. I need to finish everyone else's quest first. I'll see you back at camp. Oh no, never mind. I swear there's just a way to fast travel to the camp. Deviled Eggler, Spagiter, Millimochi, Chedorb, and then Unknown, 11th. Mukuro Snack Usaba. The, the 11th snack hidden on Big Snack Island. I want to do more Danganronpa. I did enjoy uh, Danganronpa 2. I have Ultra Despair Girls. I want to play that at some point before I play Danganronpa 3. But then I'd also have to watch Danganronpa Anime 3. No, 3 is the anime. V3 is the game. That to you. Don't mind me. I'm just stewing on what might be inside that temple and whether the others will actually help me get it open. We you will. know, for all his faults, Philbo's always willing to throw himself in the crosshairs to stop a fight and get everybody back on track. Back on Oof. track. That's something I wished I could do. All right, Flutie. What do you want to investigate? This shrinking spice intrigues me. What substance could produce such a pronounced effect on bug snacks? From what I observed, it was manufactured by ancient grumpuses, so surely it'll be simple to recreate. They seem pretty advanced, actually. Oh, please. Bring an ancient grumpus to the present and they'd be utterly lost. Anything they can do, I can do fundamentally better. Frivolities aside, I require a sample of shrink spice for study. Bring a specimen here and place it into my trough. Your mouth? No, my trough. Ugh. Oh. 
technically brought the powder. Hmm. It seems this substance becomes quite volatile when removed from its origin. A flaw in its design, perhaps. How troublesome. I may need to employ a more direct method of study. By which I mean, bring another sample here and throw it at me before it combusts. I do want to throw things at you. Isn't that dangerous? Yes, I'm told physical violence can be quite cathartic. Since the spice causes no apparent harm to bug snacks, I am reasonably certain that I will be fine. Pocket floofty. Couldn't tell. <laughs> that was rather unpleasant. <laughs> but no effect on you. <clears throat> However, having experienced that, I have learned two very important facts. One, the substance does not work on grumpuses. Two, I should not do that again. I am no closer to obtaining a usable sample of shrink spice. However, I believe we may learn something from the local. If you need a chocolate, snacks. I got Use one. Use the shrink spice to capture one cheddar and one millimochi. Then transform me with those specimens. Damn it, two of the ones I didn't have. Okay. Ched orb. Head ass ched orb. I don't know how to capture the ched orb though. It, it runs away. Okay, they're all Millie Mochis. It's not like the other ones where the subs are different. Maybe he needs more cheese. Oh, I got max cheese now. And was with okay, plus hot sauce. Oh my god. Oh my god. Oh my god. Alright. I was hoping those deviled egglers would show, would come down on them. There's the chet orb. Really? Sometimes they just don't work right.
Deviled Eggler. Cool. Didn't burrow underground, so I could probably still catch it this time. Just gotta wait for it to come back. Oh, it's big again, though. What? Shit. So that thing seems to be good at knocking it out, but... Oh, now it's on fire, of course. Come on. Just... Stop all factoring in this, this thing. There we go. No, I just need you to be st stop being on fire. Stop being on fire. Stop being on fire. Stop. De desist the fire. Holy hell, man. Just let me capture you. You have to come up here. Oh my god, dude, come on. Where'd he even go now? This is ridiculous. It's a freaking ball of cheese. Jesus Christ. Jesus Christ. This is ridiculous. Where the fuck is it? Stupid as shit. I, I really hate that this- I hate that this fucking cheddar orb is the one thing that I can't fucking catch. <sighs> okay, you motherfucker. What, what, what do I need to catch you? Because clearly I can't do it with the trap. I have to use something else. Get 
Please tell me that's gonna knock it out. Ridiculously annoying now. Also, why is this thing down here? This is just getting frustrating at this point. Like, it, it really shouldn't be this difficult to do this. Oh, come on. Really? We're doing that? And, of course, it's already back, so we're gonna wait an entire cycle for it to come back. Ridiculous. Got it now. Hey Jim, how you doing? <sighs> Always forget about the stun. All right. Shit orb. Shit orb. the shrink spice to capture one Chedorb and one Milimochi. Alright, well I got both. Alright. Milimochi leg. Milimo oh, neat. Chedorb is yum, for yum. hand. Okay. Unbelievable. Ah, decently competent work. Unfortunately... Any remnants of the spice seem to have been digested, but this too yields interesting results. In their shrunken state, the bug snacks here are not fundamentally different from those on Snack Tooth proper. Why do they grow so big? I am still forming my hypotheses, but I presume the process is endemic to this island, and the spice was created to inhibit it. Are there any side effects? None beyond the usual. <laughs> After all, Chandler ate a Bunga Royale as soon as we arrived. And he seems alive and well. You said this would be simple. It will be simple. I am merely exhausting every avenue of study. It's called being thorough. Look it up. Now, I've observed chocolates capable of maintaining a small size. This may present a more stable vessel for the spice. Regrettably, I must not eat it, delicious though it may be. So, bring one to my science trough, please. Aha! <laughs> I've already got one. The bug snack. <laughs> At last, a viable sample. Now I can extract the powder and finally put this mystery to rest. This requires my utmost concentration, and you ask far too many questions. You may return when I found my answer. Good, got your final lecture for the semester in an hour and read through your, the notes. How you doing? Uh, pretty good. And also, it sounds like you're doing pretty good. It sounds like you're about to finish up for the year, or the semester at least. I never took, uh. Why can't I retrieve it? There we go. Turn to flutey later. All right. Let's sleep till tomorrow. How's the analysis going? Blast it all! I do not need your distractions. I've obtained dried particles of plant slurry, but I have no way to analyze them. It's like living in the Stone Age out here. Perhaps if I had a particle separator, an electron microscope, and a degree in botany... Mm, bah. Plants are not my area of expertise. But we know whose area of expertise we do know it is. We do know an herbalist. You cannot be serious. 
I would sooner eat my bow tie than listen to a word of Shelda's advice. What are you afraid, afraid of? I simply do not want to waste my valuable time being lectured on archaic moral dichotomies. You're out of your depth here. Yes. I admit that I am frustrated. Under normal circumstances, I could do this without assistance. You can never contain yourself if you know Very there's chocolate well. that's okay to eat. Since you clearly won't stop pestering me about this, let us go see Shelda. One I mean, I senses constantly. the reek of a foul presence. Cease your hostilities, Shelda. I am here on business. I've been informed that you may possess a rudimentary understanding of phytochemical reactions, which I am in need of. <gasps> Strike the stars from the sky! Ooh, the wicked one there. has come to me for guidance. But surely one's ancient ways are far too primitive compared to the miracles of modern science. I do not appreciate your sarcasm. If you do not wish to help me, then simply say so and be gone with you. One would never. It is one's path to offer guidance to all who seek it, no matter how undeserving they may be. Very well. Then I require an analysis of the shrink spice. Tell me what is in it and be quick about it, please. Mm, ah, yes. A poultice made in the herbological traditions of the mother. <laughs> Though its purpose I cannot condone. If that is what you desire, then one will enter the olfactory realm to find the answers you seek. Yeah. Waft, don't sniff. I know that. <sighs> yeah, that sounds like sniffing. So many subtle aromas. Witch hazel, cinnamon, uh, black tea, each a natural remedy for inflammation. And among these astringents, <coughs> oil of vitriol. Oil of vitriol? That's sulfuric acid, a common but powerful desiccant. That certainly explains the burning sensation. Oh, there's sulfuric acid in that shit. Holy tell the journalist God. to throw acid at you. Well, this has been surprisingly not a waste of time. I am going to leave now. I may call on your services again. And you're welcome. Shall just call them a foul presence, yeah? Powder keg complete. All right. We've all finished investigating. Oh, that's nice. Well... If that's the case, then I'm gonna go gather everybody up so we can share what we all learned. This might be a long meeting, so let me know if you've still got some business to do. Ah. Uh, that's what we're going for here, huh? How many more snacks do I have to catch on here? Just one. Just the spaghetti, and then the final one, which I'm assuming is a boss. Pulls its prey into, into the canopy with its noodles. Of cheese. Alright, well, as much as I wanted to finish this tonight, I think there's still a bit more, because in addition to whatever's left here, there's then, I think, one more thing that you do on the mainland using the uh, triangle key that you found, that I found in the ruins. So I think what I'll do is I'll come back tomorrow, do the meeting, finish this area up, finish up the extra area, get the secret ending, and then I'll move on. And I should have enough time to do something else as well. So, with that being said, I think it is time to wrap it up for tonight. Two minutes ago. Uh, let me sleep. That'll probably forward time here. 5 a.m. is such a weird time to wake up. No, two minutes ago. I wish... Th I, seriously, why isn't there manual saving in this game? <laughs> Spaguiter. Spagooter. Also, why does why does sleeping not save? And for that matter, why did I lose achievements? <laughs> the vacations end achievement didn't stick. 
Neither did the survivor achievement. Very weird. Is there just a way to save? Like, why? I appreciate that it tells me the last auto save, but yeah, manual saving would, would work well here. Like, I appreciate that the game tells me when the last autosave was, but, like, if it's not autosaving after I do literally anything... It's also weird, too, because, like, the game seems to save enough that it really doesn't matter that much. But, like, right now, I don't want two minutes. Also, how is it still two minutes? I mean, I guess it's the last checkpoint, so whatever. Shouldn't be that big of a deal. It's just weird. Like, I, I just don't like the the fact that it's not, like, ma like, it doesn't save when I want it to save. Even if it was like, we're gonna save, but it'll reload from the last conversation you had. It's like, okay, that's fine, as long as I know it's gonna do that. 17 hours, 26 minutes. So we're at about the time that I, uh... Set 96 bug snacks. Wait, really? I thought there was only a like hundred. Very long two minutes. I can't only be missing six snacks at this point. Hold on, I have a few extra minutes here. I'm gonna go back in. Unless it's it's 96 plus 10 more or 11 more for the uh, for the new area. Kenneth, how are you doing? You unfortunately caught me right at the end of the stream. What's that black taco? I don't remember getting that. Oh, that's the, that's the Baja taco, isn't it? Okay, alright. Enough snacks for uh, snack decks, yeah. Bugopedia. Alright, so we're missing two here. Four there, so that's six. Nine. Done. Done. Twelve. Thirteen. Fifteen. So there's more than a hundred, so I'm missing fifteen. It says I have ninety-six. So there's 111. Okay, that makes sense, because there was 100 originally, and then 11 got added in this expansion. Yeah. Alright, so it was- so it isn't 100. That said, if I'm not mistaken, this- this last one, or there's another one that then roams the map, and it's really hard to get, and it doesn't count for completion. <laughs> or something like that. Alright, I don't think I'm gonna go for that on stream, though. It doesn't really- because I don't think you get anything for it. There's nothing worth, uh witnessing for it. Like, once I complete the story, that's kind of it. But alright. I think we've achieved what we want to tonight. Cool, cool, cool. Alright, well. Uh, this was a fun night. I hit 400 followers thanks to, uh, our buddy Pop, uh, Tevin, who showed up earlier for a little bit. Uh, cool. Yeah, neat. Okay. Yeah, sorry, I don't have much to say. Again, it's been, it's, things have been weird. And, uh, I'm just trying to, trying to get back to it when I can. So, hopefully, what'll happen is tomorrow I'll come back, finish this, and then move on to my next game. Because the truth is, I'm running tight on time now. I don't know if I'm gonna be able to finish the next game I had planned before, uh, Somnium Files 2 comes out. So, we'll see. Uh, I'll be back tomorrow, hopefully. And uh, thank you for coming. As always, thank you for stopping by, thank you for chatting, thank you for following. All, all that fun stuff. Uh, take care, 
If you want to watch more streams, check out twitch.tv slash team slash wild abandon. Plenty of people streaming there right now. Have a great evening, and I will see you around. Good night.